Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Subhajit and I make videos on Android app development. So in this video, I will talk about how to enable double back press before exiting the app or simply destroying the activity. Because in Android, if you press the back button from an activity, you might have seen that the activity gets destroyed immediately. Not only that, but also our application could be killed completely if we press the back button from the launcher activity. And this is what we are going to prevent in this video by putting a simple logic inside on back pressed method. Ok, so without any further ado, let's jump into the Android studio. Alright, as you can see, I have just created an empty project with an activity called main activity. And this is our launcher activity. Ok, so in this activity class, first we will override on back pressed method. Because this method gets called whenever we press the back button. So let's overwrite it first. On back pressed. Hit tab. Here is the method. Now along with this method, I would also like to declare a boolean variable with a false value. So private boolean, let's call it, is back pressed once. Then let's assign a false value. Ok, now I'm going to put some logic inside on back pressed. So first I will check if is back pressed once. So if this boolean is containing true, then only this super dot on back pressed should work. So let's move this line and place here. Then let's also call return. Perfect. Now we need to change these variables value to true for a certain period. Let's say for 2 seconds or 1 second. Therefore after that period of time, the value of this boolean variable will be false again. And for this we will be using the handler class. So is back pressed equal to true. Eventually we need to set a false value after a little bit of delay. I think you got it. Yes, now we are going to use the handler class. So new handler dot post delayed. Now pass new runnable. Hit tab. Then also we have to pass the delay and it should be in milliseconds like this. Mm, 2000 means 2 seconds. Finally semicolon here. Now inside this run method, we can simply reset this boolean variable. So is back pressed equal to false. Ok now see, this block of code will be triggered only when it is true. And all these bottom lines of code is about to trigger any time. So the fact of the matter is, um, here we can display a toast message like this toast hit tab type this for the context then let's type a message mm, press again to exit now let's build this project to see in action Ok, now the app should show a toast message. If I press the back button, see, press again to exit. Let's press again. See, again the same toast message appearing because 2 seconds time is being elapsed. So we have to be very quick. Let's do it again. First back press, second back press, see, the application gets killed. And this is how we can enable double back press before, before we leave the activity. So thank you so much for watching guys and spending some time with me here on the daily coding tutorial channel. If you have any questions or suggestions then please leave them in the comment section. And if you feel this video helped you a little bit hit the like button. Also do subscribe and press the bell icon so that you will get notified whenever I publish any new content. Thanks again for watching.
सी यू सुन इन द नेक्स्ट